So myelopathy, uh, which is also known as spinal cord compression, is a scary diagnosis to hear. Frequently patients will hear their surgeons say that uh, they have a high risk of being paralyzed if they fall or if they were in a car accident, but the reality is that that's far from truth in most cases and there's some great evidence to support that. Now, the way that I approach spinal cord compression is I look for symptoms. Um, and these include uh, obviously neck pain, but what's more than that and most significant, it's numbness or clumsiness of their hands or balance issues. And once patients start to develop these symptoms, it's important to obtain an MRI to really evaluate where is the spinal cord compressed. Now, about a third of patients don't progress and uh, uh, get better on their own. So I'm very conservative when it comes to myelopathy, and there are good minimally invasive motion-preserving options for patients with spinal cord compression.